What's happening YouTube? Mikhail here with another video and this one is going to be short, sweet, but very, very practical. Super excited about this one. Today, we're going to be talking about how to light your videos. So I've had a lot of people message me and ask, hey man, like, you have quite the setup there. Like, it looks really nice. Your videos are, are lit pretty cool, man. Like, you must be using some really cool lights. And the truth is, I'm not. So this video is gonna serve actually a few levels. Level number one, how to light it. Level number two, how to light it on the cheap. Level number three, how to set up in a very small space. So I'm gonna take you guys behind the scenes on my setup, on my home setup, to show you how I light my videos. In order to do that, I need another camera. But unfortunately, that camera is on a loaner. So I'm gonna use I'm gonna use this here, this here cell phone to, to film. So I'm about to bring you guys and behind the scenes look on three, two, one. And this is what I look at when I'm filming. My camera is right in front of me. And over to the left, I have this newer ring light, which is uh, anywhere between $60 and $70. I have a stand where I have my field notes. This is the notebook where I write my ideas and talking points that I want to talk about on my YouTube video. And right behind me, I have a spotlight. This is the Yono YN216. And that is the um, light that I use to spotlight um, the spot where I'm going to be standing. Um, and that's essentially my setup, you guys. I'm going to go right in front here. Um, this setup is it's actually uh, actually really, really cool because it serves the three purposes that I talked about at the beginning. It is very cheap. It is very practical. I can use it in a very small space. And uh, yeah, it's not gonna break the bank. And I don't know if you can hear that, but Lucas is calling. So uh, yeah, I have, to, uh, I have to go take care of the babe. Anyways, I'm gonna link all these items below so you can find them and uh, purchase them if you feel like it. Um, the backdrop, honestly, like you can have a plain white wall or plain dark wall or something else in the background that you can use. And, and in that, in that, in that, uh, in that situation, you would use that instead of using the spotlight that I have behind me. You could use um, you could use that light to kind of like rim light you, uh, separate you from the background, which is also a really really cool look. Um, yeah, gotta go take care of my kiddo now. Um, I'm gonna leave all the links below. Thanks so much for watching. Don't forget to like the video, subscribe if you haven't already, and ring the notification bell so you're notified when the next video goes up. I have to go get back to daddy duty. So for now, Mikhail out.